Gotta put the dog in the thumbnail. What? It's gotta put the dog in the thumbnail. Hello, pupper. Okay, well, I, I came in completely off rhythm there. <laughs> yeah, you did. Jazz musician. <laughs> All right, we're replacing you, Matt, with the dog. <laughs> oh, dog Make Matt. the show better. Wait, we're petting a dog off screen, don't yeah. worry. All right, what are we talking about? So this is a very sad video because we watched Jason X and recorded a video about it and then my SD card corrupted and we lost like four videos. Right, for all of you viewers out there. <laughs> so, two, here we are two months later. Two months post later. Post watching Jason X. I mean, yeah. we watched it yesterday because it's October. <laughs> Was it two months? Yeah, about. It's been two months. Jeez, Just soon we'll get old and then we'll die. Yeah, so Paul's we'll already 45, yeah. and you, your birthday's in, like, Monday? 45. Monday? Oh, yeah. I don't know. <laughs> Who cares? Uh, 21's, that... like, the birthday you care about. Next is 30. Can so. you replace all of the times that we mention our age with, like, some very obvious voiceover? <laughs> 20. Yep. <laughs> Well, okay, Watch Jason X. Snakes. Um, Jason X. What I remember of this film was how incredibly boring it was, and how like every turn of the turn of the millennium sci-fi, terrible sci-fi movie was like. Basically. Yeah, that this was like one in a series. Like, um, what else? What are some other movies like this? Tank Girl. Tank Girl. The uh, Matrix. That was kind of pretty nineties. The Matrix Three type thing. Um, it felt like a really bad version of The Matrix 3. Kind of Waterworld? Wha Wa Waterworld? <laughs> it had some, it had some, like, Blade and, like... Oh, yeah. Was, was Underworld out when this came out? When did Underworld come out? Hey, look uh, under there. Uh, hey, hey, Matt, edit in when Underworld came out. It came out this year. 1997. And Jason X came out this year. Ooh. It's um, the current year, Matt. 2002. <laughs> So, Jason X was super boring. I remember, like, yeah. actively uh, avoiding it and watching, uh, looking at, scrolling through terrible Facebook memes. This. So, like, so what, what was the plot here? It's, um... Jason goes <laughs> to space. Jason goes to space. I remember... You'd think at the point where you're taking the franchise to space, it's like, yeah, fuck it, we'll just have, like, a goofy, silly movie. No, it's the... It's serious! It's the same formula as all the others. Just now, it's in space. Yeah, I mean, they did have one pretty good, pretty good self-aware moment where they had the holodeck, I and did. then they had the girls that were like, uh, <laughs> "We love they, premarital sex." Yeah, they try and that distract was, that Jason. That was pretty funny. But that was the one self-aware moment. Having a holodeck of, of uh, Camp Grace. What's it called? Camp Crystal Lake. Crystal Lake. Thank you. Camp, Camp Crystal, Crystal Man. Camp Grace. <laughs> <laughs> By the power of Jason! <laughs> Lifts up a machete. <laughs> the crossover no one was waiting for. Wait, oh, is that so a, is that a... Freddy versus Jason. What? Nothing. <laughs> oh, thank you. Um, oh, that was... Yeah, that, was guess... a, that was a crossover. That was good. S yeah. Spoilers for Freddy versus Jason. Jason lives long enough to go to space. Because this came out before Freddy vs. Jason. Yeah, I don't get how they... You, you know, it's, it's like um, it's like the MST3K continuity. I oh. really don't oh. care. Oh, I don't the, care enough. I'm wearing the shirt. I kickstarted it. It shows you my taste. So you are. Yeah. I tried, to be, I tried to be nice and nerdy. White and nerdy. So I, I guess we're not breaking the tradition of using dead memes. What's the... It's white and nerdy is not a meme. It was a song. Yeah, but it was... Uh, okay. Was it a meme? It was kind of a meme. It was? I oh, mean... Okay, back to the, the subject in hand. Okay, uh, There was so... uh, one of the worst dressed, uh, ugliest looking, like, supposed to be hot girls I've ever seen. That redhead that was the android was really weird looking. And she was supposed to be 90s hot or, like, early 2000s hot. Like, but what they thought was future hot. And it was really yeah. bad. So it's like it's 90s a, future hot. It's a very dated future. She was so like, weird looking. They all were. Like, this is like what the future would look like if the Spice Girls designed it. Yeah, that's what she looks like, a Spice Girl. Except... Yeah, yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Wait, is she like the... the Force of the Fist Spice Girl, Slutty Spice or something? Robot Splice. Robo spi robot, robot Spice. spice. <laughs> yeah, she oh, wore man. all leather. Speak so, so, speaking of spice, I was gonna say that <laughs> this movie, it's like, oh yeah, we're gonna take him to space, spice up the formula. Yet, no, this is more like putting salt on dry toast. Mm. 
A wound, I was gonna say. A wound. <laughs> salt on a It's not salt on a wound. Halloween is a salt on a wound. Oh, the remake? The remake. So, yeah. Mm hmm. It's like, remember when this was good? <laughs> salt. Um, oh, excuse me. What else Plus about here. this film? Um, he oh, gets there his was new mask. There was the scene where I thought it was actually pretty clever. I like the scene where he's like, oh, you're in the nano deck, and they're like, Oh, where where the the nanobots were like searching, or like he had gotten most of his limbs cut off by the weird goth Spice Girl, and uh, I'm gonna call her Spice Girl from now on. Yeah, that, uh, that's <laughs> go for it. Um, where uh, he had gotten most of his limbs cut off by her, and he's by this like nano healing deck where the uh, they and they were looking for like organic material to make him into uh, to put his limbs back. Except they had to go searching or whatever, so they formed into arms and like a space mask, and that was cool. I like that scene. It would have been cool. If it it would have been cool been... if they used him for more than two minutes, though. It yeah. also would have been cool if it hadn't been done before. Like that was very clearly a Terminator ripoff because he had the red eyes and the. the oh, I didn't mask. even think about that. It was, and it, it this came out after Terminator Two, so the idea of like somebody... <laughs> well after Terminator Two. Like the idea of of like two a robot two. They came out like oh one odd one. Sorry, I'm pretty sure DBZ had already ripped off um, had already ripped off Terminator two, and then it got to this point where Jason X came out yeah, and, and they, they ripped off. They project it so hard. Like right at the beginning, it's like oh her arm's missing. Like put it in the deck so like she can regrow her arm. And you're it like, was him. He oh, was the stoner character. Oh, we we're gonna obviously by the end Jason's gonna fall in this and come back to life. Check off Xano robots. Yeah. <laughs> Except like they turn Check him into like this. into the hey. Uber Jason from the cover. That's like twenty minutes of the film. It was sad. If that was like it's half like, the film, it's like the new Godzilla film. Oh, wait, wait. Spoilers. Wait, yeah, yeah. It's the, the Brian Cranston Godzilla film. Okay. It's like, it's awesome whenever Godzilla shows up. But he doesn't show up till like, a good two-thirds through the movie. Like, in, in a, any way that's a monster movie. Speaking of, I watched Skong, Kong Skull Island the other day. Really good monster movie. Have yeah. you seen it? Uh, I've not... I'm waiting till Redbox sends me like a uh, free one night coupon, and then I'm gonna go rent it from Redbox. It's really good. Is it? Is it like it's, a... you turn off your brain, and it is very pleasing to the eyes. All right, back to the matter at hand. Not so, pleasing to the eyes or the mind. So Jason X. From, I would say for the, for most of the Jason series, you should just turn off your brain. Like Jason, like Friday Friday the Thirteenth, three D on. You should just turn off your brain. Friday the Thirteenth. Yes. Oh, yeah, wait. They changed it, uh, like, at, what was it, the eighth one, when Sony bought it? Uh, New Line Pictures New bought Line it. bought it. And, uh... It, oh, that's the, how the, they... Yeah, and that's, that's how... That's how they made the Freddy vs. Jason. Yes. Yeah. What? Yeah, and, what? uh, what happened was they, uh, they changed it to Jason make... Jason Takes Manhattan. Well, Jason Takes Manhattan was still Paramount. Wait, then no. they made Jason Goes to Hell, Jason X, and Freddy vs. Jason. And then there was Jason 2, Pig in the City, right? Right. right. Jason 2, Pig in the City? <laughs> what the a, hell is a, that a reference a to? Babe, babe, Pig in the City? <laughs> Whatever. I have no... Okay. It's a decent story. Alright, uh, I guess that's all we have to say about Jason X. More franchises should go to space. Like, after you've given up, just go to space. Yeah, like, it's, is that the new Jumping the Shark? <laughs> It's because like, like I'm pretty sure even Jim Henson, space. Jim Henson knew it was it was like a stupid idea to put Muppets in space, but it was funny. But it, they, he did a good job with it. I heard something recently about like it was called Muppets in Space, and then they realized none of them actually went to space, so they changed the title to Muppets from Space. <laughs> yeah, isn't that what? What is that? Uh, I was actually going for Pigs in Space Gonzo. from the Muppet Show. Oh yeah, that was also pretty funny. <laughs> The what? Pigs in Space. Pigs in Space was a good bit. No, yeah. Oh, no, yeah. The Muppet Show. Um, wait, wait, can we talk about like, that for a second? Like, talk oh, about what? Pigs the, Muppet, the Muppet Show. How incredible it was? Yeah. yeah. Did and you know that, that he was doing... Okay, so the, uh, he was doing Sesame Street and uh, The Muppet Show at the same time, and they were both weekly shows. So he was writing two shows and acting in them every week. Do you know how insane that is? Jason X. Compared uh, to Jason X. Let's see, Friday the 13th went to space. Poorly written. Leprechaun went to space a lot faster than, Jay than Friday the 13th. 
Uh, Josie and the Pussycats went to space. I mean, it took a while for Apollo to go to space. I think that was like eight. No, no, no. Apollo never eleven. Went. Eleven was the one that made it to the moon. Okay, I was trying to Good make job. a bad joke. Well, I mean, then, Star- they tried to, then they tried to jump the shark at Apollo 13, and Dude, Star- oh, everyone's gonna die. Dude, Star Wars ran out of ideas yeah. fast. Yeah, they just went back to space. <laughs> Alien. Oh my gosh. They should have just stayed on Prometheus. Jeez. Um, Alien wait, was I made a joke on Twitter that the Fast and the Furious movies should go to space, and now they're possibly going to space in the Fast Oh, the- thank God! Space cars! See, Matt, they're listening to you. It was a uh, Ronda Only Rousey my pipe. joke suggestions. I actually think the Ronda Rousey Roadhouse got cancelled. No, 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 I think it's postponed for the foreseeable future. I saw an article. Okay. Yeah. That's fake news. Fake, you are fake. You're fake news. Not postponed to the foreseeable future. Jason X. Alright. We had a lot more to say about this. It already came out. I thought we would have. Oh, I remember this one. For it was like torture. It's been late. seared in my memory. This one in particular. There were some good moments, like when the guy lands on the drill, and she's like, he got screwed. Okay, that was that was. And like, funny. he like dips the girl's face in uh, the liquid nitrogen and then smashes it. Okay, that was a good moment. <laughs> but mostly it's just the same. Most it's stab. stab it's stab, the stab, same, stab, but stab, in stab, space. Twice. And then the nerd hooks up with the Spice Girl, I think. That's yeah. the only other part of the movie I remember. <laughs> yep. And even in the movie, they realize it was forced. Yep. Anywho. And then it inspired her. I've never seen that movie, but it looked okay, so it's, I it's might... It's really good. Is it? Yeah. Everything Spike Jones does is good. See ya! Come with a saw, but I didn't die then. Come with a gun, but I didn't die then. Come with a bomb, but I didn't die then. Jason's life, they can never end. You can use a chainsaw or a shotgun. You can be a samurai or an alien. You can carry weapons, I'm not too strong. Stay